Hello everybody, Mara Ravenfire here, back for another great game of Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. Now, I'm not gonna lie, it has been a little while <laughs> since I actually played this, so it may take me a hot minute to get used to everything again, but we should be back here in good old Chinatown, where, you know, we're looking for poor dear Barabbas. Oh, that poor, poor sweet Nosferatu. We're gonna have to uh, hunt him down and free him, if I'm not mistaken, from the Tong, which is what we were in the process of doing as soon as this thing loads. Go. Load. Load, minion! I command you. So I apologize for the long time in between videos. Um, it's been a little hectic around here. I switched over jobs and got a new job, and I've been doing like 15 million billion things. So I am going to see if I can't jump right back in now. Um, and then the holiday break, I had my roommate around so I couldn't really record. But now I'm back. Now, what is this saying? Come to my brother, the Mandarin has told you he was holding Barabbas at the Foo Syndicate. Okay, so yes, all right, I know where I need to go, mostly. Right. Okay. Are you serious? Really? Really? We're gonna- Oh. I'm gonna gonna start like this, huh? Alright, fine. Fine. Come here, jerk wad. I don't get this call anymore on the corner. Okay. Oh. oh no, Billy boy. Oh no no no. No 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 no. Yeah, okay. You, you have angered me. Where's the other dude that's shooting me? Where are you shooting me from? You're shooting me from over there. Get over here. Aw, there's three of you. How adorable. Now I'm just gonna eat you. Good grief. Just wait until you're dead. I'm not even dealing with this right now. Nope. Nope, we're done. No more Mrs. Nice Malk. Hi. You wanna shoot me too, huh? Alright, there we go. I got the controls back. Sorry about that. Apparently, uh, I forget how to play this game. Alright. Let's do this. Oh, my loading times are taking a little longer than usual. That's fun. Come on. Go. There we go. Alright, Foo Syndicate. Uh, where the hell am I going? Shows uh, imports, I've already done. I'll talk about stop signs, sadly. Oh, Foo Syndicate's over there. Get out of my way, man. Oh. The masquerade area I can't do. I'll eat you later. There we go. Just in the game. I sometimes know what I'm doing. I lie. I lie. Alright, so here's where things get fun and interesting. 
if I remember right, I'm going to have a bunch of tests I'm going to have to go through, and they're going to be like, oh, well, blah, blah, blah. Test this, test that. <laughs> Only not like that at all. Voicemail 5308. Uh, yeah. oh. There we go. Sheet of paper. Out of the printer here at work. See, advantage of working for where I work for, I actually get to uh, have a lot of time on my hands to do some stuff. Okay. Oh, I have a bunch of morphine. I don't need any of it. I'll keep all of that stuff. Yeah, I'm never going to use this again. Or that. Or that. Uh, I'm going to keep my guns. Oh, it's because this is what I'm wearing. So glad you finally decided to show up. If you want to meet your comrade, walk through those doors. No, bring him out here, then we'll talk. Die. Subject will not enter the next area. This may be due to a theoretical sixth sense, or perhaps it is simply a fray. Oh, Are you no, stubborn no. by nature or instinct? Come out, we'll do lunch. <laughs> Step through the doors. Does that ever work? Subject refuses to move to the next chamber. I assure you, your comrade is still alive. If you want him released, you will do as I say. This is what I say to you. I'm coming for you. And Mara the Malkavian, don't play, homie. Good. I am told you are a rather resourceful individual. Mm. This should make you a most intriguing specimen. You and your kind may play mortals for weaklings and fools, and you that are. may be fitting for some, but you underestimate me. And you underestimate exactly how hungry I am. Subject is female. Appearance suggests early to late twenties. True age, unknown. Early to late twenties? As with the other, there are no vital signs. No heartbeat, no body heat. Test chamber air sample is 97% carbon monoxide. Normal respiration cannot take place. Subject is by all definition clinically dead. Yeah. Hello in there. Hi. I'm going to run some tests on you. Duh. I'm interested in how you work, but only because it's my task to find the most efficient way to kill your kind. Please. <laughs> Give me everything you've got. Begin the experiment. Test chamber has been filled with ultraviolet light, releasing moderate UV radiation. Does that burn at all? No. Subject exhibits no sign of pain or even physical discomfort. Shut down the lights. Conclusion? UV radiation does not produce the desired effect. But new. Please. Move on to the next chamber. What the shit is this? If you cooperate, I will give you a dog. Your kind is resourceful. Your survival instinct borders on animalistic. I'm curious about your innate abilities. Let us see if you can do it. The walls are reinforced concrete, several feet thick. There is no other exit. Believe me, it is my design. <laughs>
Only the most simple creatures can survive dismemberment. I am told you can regenerate parts of your body. I'd much like to observe this. I wonder, how many limbs can you lose before you cease to function? that over again. Yay. Yeah. Right, so as you can tell, the Mandarin's kind of a jerk. And while this is going on, I can actually clean off my screen so I can see what the heck's going on, because unfortunately this thing's a disaster. There we go. Go, my minion. <clears throat> Come on, play. Oh. Again. As with the other, there are no vital signs. No heartbeat, no body heat. Test this chamber air sample is 97% carbon monoxide. Normal respiration cannot take place. Subject is by all definition clinically dead. Yeah, see that? That's gonna happen Hello in there. I'm going to run some tests on you. I'm interested in how you work, but only because it's my task to find the most efficient way to kill your kind. Please, work. give me everything you've got. Begin the experiment. Test chamber has been filled with ultraviolet light, releasing moderate UV radiation. Does that burn at all? Nope. Subject exhibits no sign of pain here. or even physical discomfort. Shut down the lights. Conclusion: UV radiation does not produce the desired effect. You know, you need the actual sun. Please. Please move on to the next chamber. Your if you cooperate, I will give you a dog for your good behavior. I find my subjects prefer dog blood over the rats. I know the walls are real. several feet thick. There is no Only the most simple creatures can survive dismemberment. I am told you can regenerate parts of your body. I'd much like to observe this. I wonder how many... Can you lose before you cease to function? Right. You've shown great resilience so far. Let's see how you do against some live targets. Proceed to the next room. Sometimes myths are constructed around legitimate observations. Let us find out if there's any truth in an old superstition. Initiate Van Helsing experiment. Does that hurt? I'd rather the Van Helsing hypothesis tests false. 
No, I'll just shoot you. When God fails, put your faith in the gun. Proceed, Commander. Oh, the men are veteran mercenaries. The weapon modifications are... Refined incendiary. I promise you. Suggest field What is it doing? All right. I'm gonna play this game, huh? Oh, uh, what is it doing? Killing your men. to be a very useful guinea pig but we have a conflict of interest you continue to endure even though it's my instruction and to incapacitate you this calls for a more drastic approach continue to the next room I'm very enthusiastic about this next test of course you are Oh, oh, that's probably just that one. Oh, it's in there. Alright, there we go. <sighs> Healing. Ugh. <sighs> Many regimes use electricity to torture information out of their captives. It would be useful if this applies to your kind as well. Or will the voltage have results similar to fire? Let's find out. You have demonstrated considerable mental and physical acumen. And I'm quite perplexed how something that should be dead can display such strong survival skills. Let's begin the final test. Step into the next room. Why, what if I get in? There we go. Stand by. Run a check on the extinguishers one more time. I've already determined fire is a weakness of your kind. I would like to know more about the psychological effect it has on you, and how it may be exploited. Hurry up and reload! Yeah, Mandarin. Fuck you.
out of here and go find Barabbas. Hey buddy, what's up? I'll get you out of here. Okay. Blood buff. Whatever. They get you too. Now I've got no excuse. A Nosferatu getting caught by a bunch of humans. <sighs> This is a new low. I'll just chill. Are you Gary's Chinatown eyes? Wait! We can't go yet! There are servers here. We need to hack in and delete all of their research. Should be a mainframe on this floor. Mm, computers and I are both a little buggy, so we get along well. Let's check the computers. Anything on Kindred needs to get wiped. Anyone interferes, you leave them to me. If I tore the lungs out of everyone in this place, I it still Barabbas. wouldn't feel like revenge. Honestly, I think the Nosferatu are by far the most well-fleshed-out clan in this game. With the exception of player characters, because then Malkavians get the best dialogue. I'm good at things making, di making things disappear, especially myself. Come, we fly. Swing an apparatus. Hey, hold it! Hey, stop right there. Freeze! Hey, I was eating that. Damn it, Barabbas, I was hungry. Oh, look. Hey, Let's go. Okay. I'm trying to. Hey, hold on. Bugged out a little bit. I'm still hungry. Hey, stop right there. Sure, quad. All right. Uh, species dash X data. Autopsy? Really? Purge. Door code. Hey, hold it. Stop right there. Code. Oh, freeze! Hey, hold it. Seven, three, two, seven. I think. Okay. Hey, stop right there. Hey, hold on. Dude, Barabbas, what the hell, man? That's the last of them. Let's get out of here. Speed your tail to the underground. Run. Will do. And thanks. No problem, Barabbas. All right. We got Barabbas. Next step, uh, we wait for Gary to tell us where the hell the Ankaran sarcophagus is. 
I already know where it is. I don't want to go there. I don't want to deal with it. I'm going to deal with it, but I don't want to do it, but it's going to happen. Rar. Don't want to deal with this nonsense. <laughs> so sad. So sad. Eh. Whatever. We'll deal. And it will be okay. Do you have Prince Albert in the can? Well, better let him go, boss. <laughs> you done real well bringing our boy back home. I got your info, hero. Yes? The same information I gave your prince, I also traded to the Giovanni for a bit of... juicy gossip. You both had an equal opportunity to take it. They just had a bit more initiative. Question mark, question mark, question mark. If you're going to play jihad, you need to do your homework. Knowledge is power, and power has a price. But seeing as how I've already got what I want from them, I'll give you a freebie. I love the Nas so much. What are Giovanni? Oh, you're going to love this. They've got skeletons in their closet. Literally. <laughs> I should have played the cat skills. Incest, organized crime, death cults. That's the Giovanni. Spaghetti and corpses, boss. Oh, yeah. Tell me the deepest secrets of the Giovanni. The Incaran sarcophagus isn't the only occult item they're hoarding. I hear they've got a collection that'd make Alistair Crowley come back from the dead. That is, assuming he isn't already sitting on a shelf somewhere over there. True. Where did Giovanni grow? Oh, I'll tell you. And if you're foolish enough to go there, well, don't say I didn't warn you, boss. You didn't warn you. They have a mansion in the city. I'll draw you a map. They're having a reunion. Anyone who isn't a Giovanni shouldn't get within 50 yards. Tonight, I am a Giovanni. I must attend the party. <laughs> am I the only one who saw this coming a million miles away? I saw it too. <laughs> you get him, boss. You give him one for Gary. If you should survive and ever need any information, come back and see me. I'm always here. And everywhere. Yeah, yo. Uh, now I know not to whisper in my sleep. I am gone. Quickly! The cab. The cab of pain. Actually. First shock. Then cab of pain. You're new. Who are you? It's pale face and then this cloud. Crowd, look away. I need to go shopping. To the white cloud. I think. I think I can buy things here. I hope I can buy things here. I'll be sad if I can't. You are always welcome here. Thank you also, Malkavian. Yes? Never mind. Can't buy things here. Uh, I need to get blood. Right, so I'm going to go do a quick stop in Santa Monica, buy some blood, after selling off a bunch of useless crap. Uh. Back in a minute, guys. When I come back, we will be in the Giovanni Manor. She's a 
side quest. It should be a side quest. Let's check. You're new. Who are you? Uh... Which Shen should I answer? Uh, are you feeling alright? Take a blow to the head, maybe? Several. There are many in my skull. Some are well, others are not. Oh, I've heard of your kind before. You're a Malkavian, aren't you? You probably already know what I am, don't you? The dancing dragon speaks truth. I know better than to beat around your bush. Look, I want to get out of Chinatown. Go see the rest of Los Angeles. Maybe have some fun. But I need you to leave. Are you game or what? Let's go, call the cabbie and smell him later. Hell yeah, that's what I like to hear. What is your whim? I've heard Hollywood has some killer strip joints. Wanna check it out? The dragon chases cats. The first thing you need to know about me is that I'm into just about everything. If it fucks, I'm willing to try it once. And I'll do it again, if it felt good. This is a side quest, holy shit. Hey, let's dance around the rim of the volcano. I have no idea what's going on now. But all right, we'll have some fun. We'll do the thing. Things will thing. Stuff will stuff. Hmm. It's still going, right? Yeah. All right. Got about 15 minutes before it yells at me again. Oh. Ooh so, grab a couple girls, enjoy a slow dance, and take them down fast. Sound like a plan? I was never patient with my fear. Oh, know. come on! You've never dreamed of experimenting before. Especially now, when you're dead, and so... free. My minds are unfettered, but I'd rather you star in the fantasy. I see what you're thinking, you little slut. Good suggestion. I will try anything once, after all. This one could teach the dragon pleasures yet, but... You make a convincing argument, but... We'll save it for later. I promise. Right now, I'm starving. I really need to feed. I'll go talk to some of the girls. Meet me in that room in the back, and we'll start our little party. Whee! Looks like I got... Oh, um, looks like we got carried away. It was hard to let go. She was so fresh and spicy. And tasty. We should probably blow this joint before someone notices. Where's the bloody book for I'm this? ready for a little bar hopping. You know anywhere worth mentioning? And there has to be dancing. <laughs> I'm ready to dance. I feel like I'm gonna lose a lot of humanity with this. We drive the angels out of the city tonight. All right, let's hit it. I don't remember this being a quest. This is new. This is strange. I accept. Oh, Lord. Lordy, lordy. Hey, I'm going, going to grab some drinks. Oh, I know where I'm at. 
bartender. I'm gonna need five shots of Jack. And you have a kitchen. Can I get a sampler plate of whatever you've got? You gotta take your shots with some crappy fried food. Or it's not a night out. Shall we eat, drink, and vomit it back up later? You mean blood really is the only thing you'll eat? Ah, oh, damn. You really did get all the hard knocks in on life. Give me a whiff of your fries and a mop of my saliva or else. And a mop of my saliva. Okay, okay. I'll pass on the food. But I'm still getting wasted tonight. Team Liquor is truly your lover. My philosophy is simple. Enjoy life. Embrace your passions, your pleasures. People make themselves so unhappy resisting the things that make them feel best. I can't understand why. What opened your third eye to hedonism and hindered? Kuei Jin largely agree that on life actually kind of sucks. And that we need some kind of tangible experience to escape it. What we don't agree on is the best way to do that. So we all come up with different, neat little ideas about the true path to enlightenment, and we call it a dharma. What is this path lead the dragon, she hopes? The way I see it. The only way we're going to understand what it means to be dead is to understand what it means to be alive. So, I live each night like it's my last night. This is my path in life. My dharma. Are there other critters that walk with the dragon? Yes, but they're all terrible. There's a dharma that would prefer to suffer for eternity rather than enjoy the life all around us. There's another path that would have us move around and study the dead. The dead! The chance to live again and they would waste their time on the dead. This is why we name you the dragon. Yeah, I caught that. I was wondering why. How you knew my dharma is called the Dance of the Thrashing Dragon. I get the feeling there's a lot more going on behind that stupid grin than you'd like anyone to think. Yeah, there is. I don't know, Octavian. That's what we do. My gray matter is packed to the brim. How do you want to lose some of it here? Well, wait. I've wondered about Kindred. Do you have some kind of similar path? Do you have a purpose? The Sire's bloodline is what leads us down our different paths to a home called a clan. Hmm. So what's your clan's mantra? We are Malkinadian. We are the window between this world and the others. Yeah, I can tell you're a lot of things. Your vocabulary alone certainly makes for an interesting conversation. Well, enough to chat. What do you say we show these kids what it means to dance? Call the doctor. I'm about to break several moves. Perfect! Let's go shake our asses until we find our next morsels. With the dancing. Equation. Weird combination. That's awkward dancing. Super awkward. Why am I dancing so awkwardly? This is embarrassing. I don't dance like that anymore. Hey, you might have removed the party over where it's quiet for a bit. I just met these two guys. They seem cool, and I think they might be able to open us up. You know what I'm saying? And a dance with Mary Jane, we shall take. Glad to see you're not some, some kind of uptight straight edger. Shh. Kindred, it doesn't affect me. No, just be cool. Follow my lead.
So, uh, you guys party or what? Yeah, let's pass it over, man. Alright. This is some premium shit, so don't cash it out. Relax, I've done this before. Anyway, this episode, You'll you feel that pretty quick. Good stuff, eh? Not bad, not bad. So this is not an episode for children. I didn't even realize this was here. So, you and her? You guys an item or what? What? No, we're just friends. Oh, cool. Uh, I think I might ask her to dance then. Actually, I think I'd rather show you some new moves. Talk about a couple of winners. But at least they delivered. Tastes like he had a hint of whiskey in him. Definitely some beer. Import, I think. Quite good taste, actually. Anyways, the buzz should kick in pretty soon, so things should get interesting. Narcotics were not known to this one in the end life. My mind will only get larger now with this knowledge. <laughs> oh, man. Getting crunk on stoners is just the beginning. You really want to get fucked up? Try sucking heroin out of a messed up drug dealer. Been there. Done that. Actually hitting the bowl is just a wasted gesture at this point. But I always do it, you know, for the sake of tradition. Anyways, I think it's time we moved on, don't you? This place has a good freak show factor, but I want to take it up a notch. I want to see the freakiest place north of Orange County. Maybe even find someone to take home tonight. Okay then. This time we finally committed to the asylum. Time to go back to Jeanette and Teresa's place. Let's have some fun, kids. I may just have enough time to finish this up and then end the video for today and then move on to the next. Oh, good grief. Talk about fun. Do, do, do. Come on. Go. Go, Minion, go. There! Those are the ones that left those girls for dead. I can practically smell the wretched sin fuming off of that one. Get him! Oh, please. Hunters. They never learn. Looks like we'll be sending a few more to meet their fabled god. Oh, that. <laughs> Pathetic zealot. Okay, hold on, gotta drop some stuff. I'm kindred. Violence is nice, but I'll go back to fucking and feasting soon enough. Okay. That's weird. Weird buggy quest.
Never done that one before. Hmm. Oh. Interesting little story though. Wild little ride for our lovely Malkavian. Try to do what we can and apparently enjoy a night with a collision. Okay, so I was thinking, this time, maybe we go try our best pickup lines to get some boys and girls to join our party, then meet up later. Very well, let's face Shaw Hunt. We need more than most. Cool. Grab the hottest date you can find and meet me in the bathroom. Nom nom nom. My mind left long ago, but my eyes have not been able to see my <laughs> mm. One of my personalities should have been Rembrandt so I could mm. I'm not fully functional, but I am programmed in multiple techniques. You got mirrors in those hands? Oh, Jesus. These mirrors are only seen by the terrorists of the mall. I like it. She's hot and she's clever. So what's going on tonight, baby? God, this is so bad. My lesbian lover and I see command me for a sin sandwich. Tell me then, sweetheart. I'm here in party. I'm a gay little lamb. <laughs> stand in the way of our wisdom, as for the daughter, of Janus, only our common ancestor is Father Malkov. So, the court ordered you to help this kindred in need? Or she was part of your womb, or what? Or do you typically just walk around town solving people's problems? This query could be considered if woo was a word. The woo is like... Okay, so, imagine you die, you come back. You get taken in by this secret society. And then you find a few others. Maybe like three or four that you see eye to eye with. You guys form a sort of posse that sticks together the next 100 years or so. It's kind of like joining a family in the afterlife. But it has to be in your siblings. Friends are a foreign fixture to which I heard. You're talking to this new life all alone. Not too much. That's the path we will all walk at the end of the night. Melodrama aside, what's important? It's really hot. All the rules in a certain area tend to stick together. Pick a leader. And, and handle all this shit together. And just a way to stay organized. LA, for example, we have the Fort in Chinatown. As I am, dear, dear, she goes to 
Jester Prince waves his scepter around in an empty room. The real power lies in the Anarch's fiery heart. I've heard rumors that there's a rogue group of vampires that used to rule the streets of L.A. before anybody else showed up. Must be the same guys. Honestly, if it were left up to me, I'd run Chinatown the same way. I love my boo, but I don't see the point of this corrupt court or any of the other bullshit that goes along with it. We can find enlightenment just fine on our own. Take to the streets, I'll take you on. Until then, let's leave it. No, uh, let's pick up tab and leave. I think I'm finally ready to come down with the night. Can you chill places around here with the mellow out? Mellow, chill, wind down? Where do you hide this voracious vocabulary? No, I'm being serious this time. We don't need some balance, even a team. Search that diner? Search that diner. The ocean is opulent, it's taking some waves. Not the beach, apparently. So, we just had a night with Equation. All right. I'll, I'll let it ride. We'll finish up this quest and then finish up the video for today. I think I had a couple of minutes there where I was able to, or I forgot I was recording, and uh, had to, should have stopped my timer and didn't. So we can finish this up, and that will be it for now. For now. Only for now. Come on. Go with the loading. Load better. It's loading poorly at the moment. I apologize. Come on. The ocean is so beautiful. Not a bad way to end the night. Jose, Jack, and Johnny have been trying to loosen your tongue, yet still the dragon's dance is enigma. Me? I... You don't really want to know. Do you? Really, I, I don't want to bore you. The dragon is obscured in a shot shroud of mystique. This you know. Now tell us how the, uh, the dance began. Well, first thing you should know is that I haven't always been a woman. My name hasn't always been Kalyan, either. Okay. Rock on. Enlighten this one. Nobody decides who gets a second chance. It just happens. In some cases, you don't even get to choose how you come back. In my case. I used to be a man named Kai. This, what you see now, was his girlfriend when we both died. Okay. You both met the same end at the same hand. Overdose. Heroin. Callian got me into some pretty hard shit, when I was still so young. She was a little bit older, and she was my first. She had me wrapped around her little finger. I was so dazzled with sex. Everything in my world seemed so new and fresh. It was easy for her to bend me any way she wanted. How many years had you seen? We met in university. I was just 19. We got a batch from a guy that wasn't our usual hookup. This stuff must have been too pure, or laced with something nasty. But after we shot up, we were both on the floor. It wasn't until I came to my senses, days after I had eaten what was left of my own former body, that I realized who I was or what had happened. It wasn't until then I realized I'd become Chinmei and got a grip on things. 
It's a miracle I've made it to where I am today. Does your soul always flow so easily from one shell to another? Who knows? The universe has a cruel sense of humor, I guess. When the troubled spirit wills it, you come back. To fulfill whatever karmatic balance you upset when you were alive. Sometimes, the universe wills that you experience the second breath from a new perspective. Paint me the big picture. What debt do you need to sell? When I was brought into Kuei society, he introduced all these different dharmas to me. But the dance of the thrashing dragon really struck a chord with me. This love for life and experience sits well with me, I think. My purpose is to revel in all the things that I missed out on, dying so young. And to help others experience life, so they don't make the same naive mistake I did. It's just a sick irony that I have to do it through the body that led me astray in the first place. A terrific tale that puts this one's romp in the hay gone wrong to shame. Thanks for listening to me. Not many know that whole story. You're one of the lucky few, Bloodsucker. Keeping stories and secrets is my favorite game. Well, I could stare at the Pacific all night. But we're just about out of time. The sun will be up in an hour. I hope I don't need to tell you that's not worth sticking around for. Here's bingo next week at the Senior Center. Shall we call it date number two? Yeah. I guess this is good night. I think you know this is also goodbye. We may both be living in L.A., but... We're worlds apart. It's a pity. I had a lovely time tonight. Likewise, let luck guide you, my lady. Hi, it's the new kid on the court here tonight. She's with a fucking boy, Jim. I guess. Are you a traitor or just stupid? She's a goddamn Gui Jin. Silly vampires, why are you yelling at a harmless street sign? Hey, what the hell? Why are you yelling at those street signs? Wait, why am I yelling at street signs? Uh, I don't feel good. I think it's time to head back. Letters will be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. Well, that really comes in handy, doesn't it? We better get out of here before they come back. This night was not wasted. Carry yourself well. What up, bitches? You may be Camarilla Pawns, but I ain't gotta listen to your shit. That's about as gangster as I ever get. Sorry. But alright, so we are going to go ahead once I finally am able to pull up my menu again and end our video for today. Come on. Go. Go, go, go. Minion, do as I command. Apparently that quest just lags me out like crazy. Alright, so... This is where we will leave for the day. Uh, this has been a Mar Raven Fire with the Vampire the Masquerade Clan Quest Mod Malkavian Edition. Uh, if you like the video, go ahead and tap like for me. If you want to see more, go ahead and hit subscribe. Check out some of the other stuff I've got here on the channel. But good night, good luck, and I will catch you guys next time.